Hello everyone, it's it's another P.O. Box unboxing, but the thing is, this box I got from good old Bobby C. Yet again, he has sent another parcel. It's very large. It's a very large box. It's huge. I had to go to, uh, behind the desk to get it. And perfect timing because they literally closed the door right behind me when I uh, went to do it because they just closed right when I went in to claim this package. So if I was like a minute later, I would have had to seriously wait like until Monday to get this thing. And it's Friday. So thankfully, perfect timing. I got this. Um, so let, let's open it up and let's let's just get to the chase. But I need a knife. Can can someone bring me a knife? Here you go. I am the Eldora Brute with a knife right here. Uh, all of the illusion is gone because you have to see J4's hands, but... Here you go, J4. Oh, thanks, old or brute. Oh, you're welcome. You might have met my cousin, the Dark Army. I'm like him, but I've got four legs. Doop -doop. I liked the weird Dark Army character I did. And here's the Eldora brute. I just built him. He's cool. Yeah, I like him a lot. But anyways, yeah, let's just open this up. Let's let's take a look. Um, and let's see what amazing stuff lies within this. It's huge. Like, I'm not joking. It's huge. I have no idea what he sent me. Uh, but we'll see. It's been a while since we've had a nice big juicy P.O. box like this. And Bobby usually always sends some pretty interesting stuff. So, let's take a look. We have this. Nice. We have, oh look, more of it. I like stabbing it. When I was when I was younger, like a lot of people like popping it. I like stabbing it. But le yes, let's uh, let's take a look. Alrighty, fourth of August, twenty twenty, GCC two 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 four. It is time for trash, treasure, or other. You decide. Hope this package finds you well and in good health. I'm doing I'm doing well in this mad world of ours. This pandemic of viral stupidity and other things going on in the world. At least they're still making toys. Collectible ones at that. So many toys at so little time. So, so true. 2020 has been an awful year for everything besides toys. Toys have been amazing, but even then, like, trying to get them has been really hard. Like, all these exclusives are killing me. Um, continue to take care of yourself and do well. And if this is the last that you hear from me, it is not because of the virus. It is because postage has become too expensive. Well, if you, if you do uh, ever decide postage is too expensive, feel free to shoot me an email or anything if you've got email, my man. Um, you have, you've been very kind to the channel, and I like you very much, Bobby. You're a good guy. But best regards... Best regards. Best <laughs> regards, Bobby. Thank you so much, man. I hope you're doing well as well. You said you are, but I hope you're, oh, you're still doing well. I've been doing all right. Uh, a lot of things in my life have been put on hold, but... It could be a lot worse, right? <laughs> it could be a lot worse. Anyways, this is the first thing I'm seeing. Um, I've been curious about these Scout class things from Cyberverse. And he's got me the the, the Sting Shot Bumblebee Scout class. These things like half transform. You see that? It's like it half transforms. So I'm very curious. Very curious. Thank you for that. Let's set that down. Ooh, that's... Ooh, this is... I don't remember seeing this on your shelves when you went through the collection. May have missed it. Oh my! I wanna, I wanna save that for last because that seems really interesting. Um, oh my! Big bag of junk, but I love it. Ooh, we have a. Uh, I'm assuming this is Zeus from uh, Heracles. Jeez, I hope it's not too washed out. I feel like all these weird videos are just super washed out. Yeah, there's Heracles. That's not Heracles himself. There's one of them Mighty Ducks, I think. I'm not too well versed into into Disney. Oh, here's like a a Mario toy. Um, he's got like a backpack on. He doesn't have sleeves for some reason. That's odd. Oh, it's like a slot machine. I don't I don't get that, but <clears throat> I also am not a Nintendo guy. Then we have Santa Pen. I'm gonna have to keep a lot of this stuff in here, man, because it's just oh my goodness. I love these things though. I for, I always forget the name. There's the name. 
I always forget the name, but I love these things. They're made of like this really nice hard plastic. I love them. They're like these weird little characters in this weird little shape. I had a few of them growing up. Um, what else we got? We got... Um, oh, another one. Oh, that's that's a really cool looking one. Very different from the ones I've had. Oh, we got a, <laughs> a freaking... Oh my gosh, Paw Patrol. That's Marshall, right? Yeah, Marshall. Uh, when you stock toys at retail, you end up learning all of their names. I just burped a little bit, but there's another Mighty Duck. I think is what those are. Soft truck toy. That would have really bothered me as a kid because it doesn't have real wheels. Hey, there's a... Uh, Gecko, I think, from PJ Masks. And then, oh, here's a Golden Ranger. Well, that's kind of really cool. I like how he kicks like that. I'll have to put that with my Power Ranger stuff. All the rest I'm just going to have to keep in this bag of random goodies. Oh, that is sweet. That is sweet right there. Wow, I really like that. I'm gonna have to go some. I'm gonna have to go through this a little bit more on my own. Oh, that almost looks like a putty. Now we got some balls. I'm gonna have to gloss over that one a little bit. There's also a duck in there. Megatron would be very happy with that. So that's one bag o random. And here we have oh boy. <clears throat> Oh boy. Um, we have. Ooh, this is like a Sam Raimi Spider Man McDonald's toy. I really like that. I might actually try to display that. I love Sam Raimi Spidey stuff. Dang it. I had. At least I think this is supposed to be Tony, right? I had plenty of the uh, Iron Man. I have like two Iron Man and I have like a War Machine, but I think this is supposed to be a Tony. From that. From that line of uh, Endgame toys. And then here's another Endgame of another Iron Man. I think I already have this one. Yeah, I've got that Iron Man, but now I've got in the bag. Whoa! I haven't been too into the uh, McDonald's scene lately. Like, even if they do something for Transformers or Marvel, I'm not really too well-versed in it. So I need to start keeping up with that a little bit more. Okay, more figures. Oh, God. Why... So here we have um, Elastigirl. Um, oh my goodness. Those proportions. Oof. So we have her. And then we have Superman! Very oddly proportioned Superman. He's got the biggest arms of all time and the tiniest little... I think his arms are bigger than his legs. And then we have... I think I might already have this one. Spider-Man just... Without a missile, he looks awful. And you, something with real hair. This is Katana! At least I think. Yeah, this is Katana! I'd, be advi I'd advise not getting killed by her. Her sword traps the souls of its victims. Hey, jump cut, because my camera decided to stop recording, because I think I just need to get a new memory card. Anyways, jeez, what was this called? Galador? Oh, yuck. This was Lego. Lego did this. I think it was called Galador, right? Absolutely disgusting toy line. Like, they looked awful. They are awful. This is just... This is bottom-of-the-barrel trash. Like, what was Lego thinking with this? Out of here. Just... I don't even want to look at it. Ew, gross. Let's unwrap one... Of, oh, oh, this is kind of cool. I don't really need it for my collection, because I already have, like, a plush one. But this is, like, the basic ducky. That's cute. I like that. I don't know what I'll do with it, but I enjoy it. The Toy Story basic line from Mattel. Like, look at this. Look at all the articulation. This was pretty legit. Like, they really put a lot of effort into the basic line. Like, I can see people just wanting to collect the basic line. I, I really can. Because they did a good job. And here, oh goodness. We've got quite a bit of, like... Cheapy Bionicle Boys. I know this isn't Bionicle. I've come across a few of these before. If anyone can ID this for me, that would be great. I think I've had some of these in the past. That's kind of cool. I like that. But a lot of these are like... Oh, there's another one like it. There's another one like that guy. But a lot of these are the... Uh... Ooh, this is a Transformer. Or... Ooh. 
<laughs> it's a knockoff transformer of Brims. Uh, I think Brimstone. Isn't this guy Brimstone from Cybertron? I want to say, I want to say it's Brimstone. I have the official toy. Uh, this is odd, very odd. I do have the I do have the real one. I'm actually looking at it right now. I want to say he's Brimstone. I think so. Um, but then again, I always film these late, and I can never remember. Yeah, we've got some Bionicle dudes in here. We got this boy, which is cool. I've never been well-versed in Bionicle. These are like the McDonald's toys for Bionicle. Yeah, these I really have liked these things, though. Oh, that's a cool one. I don't think I've ever had this one. I like that. And then... Oh, that guy looks sweet. Like, these are cool, man. Like, even if it's just action figures like that, they're really nice. And then it was the other... Oh, my goodness. Ah! I'm dropping stuff. I think the other leg to this... I want to call him Brimstone, yeah. The other leg's actually in there. So... Even though... Doesn't he kind of need, like, an animal head? Oh, jeez, I forgot it was on... On this leg. This is so weird. I'm sorry if it's so washed out. I don't want it to be. Yeah, I'll have to see if I can fix that. If I really care to. <laughs> yeah, there's... I want to call him Brimstone, but I feel like the more I say it, and if it's wrong, the bigger an idiot I'm going to look. And then... Oh, yes! Look at that! Oh, my gosh! This is so sweet! It's uh, Slam Fist. It's a plushie of Slam Fist from Small Soldiers. Oh, my gosh! Sanctuary Sanctuary! Oh, my gosh. I love this. Wow. I didn't even know they made plushies like this. That is awesome, man. Thank you. It's going on my small soldier shelf for sure. Okay. Got a couple other little things in here. Ooh. Some bionicles that fell in. But we got... Oh, look! Some little Toy Story 4 uh, minis. Let's see if I can tear into these real quick. If only I had a knife right here. Oh, wait. I do. So here we have... Hey! Another ducky, but this time he's diseased. He's green now. A little diseased ducky. That's cool. I always like my toys being diseased. And then this one. It's another ducky, I swear. Hey, look! I really like this one. It's uh, Duke Kaboom. That is sweet. Epic. Except they painted his eyes over his visor. I don't know if you can see that. It looks really weird. Yeah, it's Duke Kaboom. I like Duke Kaboom. Probably my favorite character from Toy Story 4, at least new characters. Even though, like, Bo Peep is amazing. So anyways, this is, uh... I don't know... I don't... Uh, I know you don't actually collect this line of toys, but this armored blue guy seems appropriate for a miscellaneous shelf. Pay close attention to his unique... Thing. Oh, man! I feel bad, because <laughs> you might have missed it. I own this guy. I did buy it. Um, I'll keep, I loved the box. So I'm going to keep this in the box. Um, this is sweet. I already do own this guy, Bobby, because I am a sucker for blue armored guys. And I saw Alternation, and I'm like, yeah, I need this. So I bought it. Um, but now I have one to keep in the box, because this box is so freaking awesome. Like, look at that. This is awesome, dude. Thank you. Yes! I love this package! Wow, man, like... I already have it, but I still re I'm really hyped. I'm re I really love that thing, thank you. But then, that thing I want to say for last... I don't remember seeing this one on your shelves when you went through the collection, may have missed it. What is this? Ooh. Oh, I do not have this one. But I will take it, because I like myself some Iron Legion. They call it they call it Beam Blaster Iron Man. No, it's it's the Iron Legion, obviously. But that's that's pretty cool, man. Um Oh it lights up. A little little light up right there. Rad. Uh yeah, I don't do these twelve inch things too much. I'm trying to cut down on ending up with all these weird 12-inch Marvel figures, but hey, it's an Iron Legion, man. I'll take it. I still love how they're trying to market it as Iron Man, though. Like, I think more kids would buy it if you... Oh, excuse me, burp. Called it the Iron Legion. Anyways, man. 
Let me dig these bionicles out of here. Spoiler, J4 is wearing a red t-shirt. Yeah, there's that. Here, let's get this big old box out of the way. You can see my, my carpet shouldn't be too dirty because I just vacuumed a little bit ago and I don't actually go in this room too much. But yeah, we got Iron Legion. I feel kind of bad that you sent this to me because you probably didn't see that I already owned it. But still, I will totally take another Sabotage from Alternation in the box. Got a lot of random toys. I had to keep a lot of them in the bags. Little Bumblebee. Some more random toys. We'll just put those in the front. Golf. Can't forget the little Toy Story boys. Right there. Uh, Duke Kaboom just fell. We'll just sit him there. Did they come with stands? No, they did not. And then let us not forget him. I think that was... Was this... I think this was uh, Keegan-Michael Key. I think so. I think he was Key and Bunny was Peel. I think so. I don't know. I, I always... I, I liked Key and Peel for a while when I heard that Key and Peel was uh, Ducky and Bunny. I was pretty hyped. And then those. And then... Let's just put those guys right there. I don't even know if you can see him. But yeah, that's uh, that's everything. Sorry, you can see my foot. Spoiler alert, J4 has a foot. What? And he doesn't wear socks around the house? Worst YouTuber ever. Unsubscribe. Uh, but yeah, there we go. Another awesome box from Bobby. Uh, pretty hyped for that sabotage. Because I just love that box so much. And just having one in the box is pretty exciting. Because I already have one loose. So, yeah, I I really like that. It's a huge box. It'll it'll bite me in the ass when I end up, like, needing to find the real estate for it. But, yeah, awesome stuff, Bobby. I really do. I always appreciate it. I always appreciate the stuff you send. I'm, I'm really grateful that you think of me with a lot of this goofy stuff. And um, it, it, some of it will at least have a temporary good home for me for now. Um, but I, I'm <laughs> I, for sure at some point I'm going to have to let go of a lot of this uh, weird stuff that I have been, I've acquired throughout the years. I can't hold on to everything. I just want to think of the best way to get rid of it because, like, fans sent it to me, but at the same time, I don't really need it, so I've thought about what to do with it. I don't know. We'll see. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sell it and make a profit, no. I'm not gonna make a profit off of your generosity. Uh, but yeah, guys, there we go. Awesome stuff from Bobby. If you want to send anything in the P.O. Box, here is the address. Feel free to send something my way, and I will uh, I will unbox it on the camera. So yeah, there we go. Uh, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Check out my social media links, PO Box address, and free people ask questions down in the description below. Have a good day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.